Hey guys, back again. Casual piano player. And, um, you know, just want to share my knowledge of music with you best I can. Um, I'm not perfect. And um, I guarantee you it'll sound as close to the record as possible. So this next song is uh, Tina Marie's Out on the Limb. Very pretty song, soulful song. So I'm going to teach you how to play it now. So uh, let's start with the uh, intro. So the intro, we got F sharp minor nine and it goes to a b minor nine so it's f sharp minor nine or uh <coughs> f sharp minor nine and a b minor nine so of course you don't play these well you can play the chords and the melody but i'm gonna teach i'm gonna do the simple version i'm gonna give you uh f sharp c sharp and f sharp in your left hand and then um we're gonna do I'll show you the melody line so you got to um so that's pretty much the the first half of it the intro f sharp octaves in your left hand one five one f sharp um c sharp f sharp and then you got this uh little melody so you got um this is g sharp f sharp and d flat so and then the second part of that is the b minor which you're gonna do b F sharp and B, and then you got um, so you got um, that's going to be A, F sharp and D, A, F sharp and D, and it's just like a, a little movement. Then you do, at the end of that, you do like a little grace note from A to B. Real simple. So I'm gonna play the whole thing for you, real slow. Let's move. So let's play it in time. One more time. All right, now first verse, the same two chords. Tender. So um, I'm gonna show you the chord now. So the same thing in the, in the left hand, you got F sharp, uh, C sharp, and F sharp. And in your right hand, you got A, C sharp, E, and G sharp. So A, C sharp, E, G sharp. <clears throat> Which is an F, a F minor nine chord. So tender was the kiss when you held me captive in your warm embrace. Um, you could do a passing chord to get back to the F sharp minor. Uh, well, let me show you the B minor first. So you got B and F sharp in your left. Then you got um, A, uh, C sharp, D, and F sharp. <clears throat> Again, that's A, uh, C sharp, um, D, and F sharp. So, <clears throat> so that's the first two chords. Da -da 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 -da. Now you could do a C sharp minor nine, which is this chord, because you're gonna learn this anyway in the um, coming up. So um, we we'll show it to you now. It's uh, C sharp, G sharp in your left, and you got uh, B, D sharp, E, and G sharp. So again, that's D flat, G sharp in your left, and in your right you got B. D sharp, E, and G sharp. So, so I'm gonna show you how that comes in. So you got the F minor nine. See how that quick passing chord? Now you don't have to do it. I mean, it sounds nice, and I, and I don't know if they do it or not in the song, but um, you know, I'm just giving it to you in case you want to add that because the bass goes. So I'll show you that bass line. F sharp, 
sharp, then you walk it up, F sharp, G sharp, A, F sharp, to the B, so. Sorry. Little flick. So it was real, real nice, simple. songs definitely listen to them so you can know the feel of the song because it'll be easier for you to learn the chords if you kind of know the song already so um yeah so my advice is definitely listen to the songs a couple times through you know get it in your, in your you know your spirit and you know uh it'll be easier for you to understand the, the way the chords flow so once you finish that you go to the chorus um or, or the pre-chorus i guess so she goes um B, same chord. Baby, baby, baby. Back to the F minor. Chord is a mystery. Oh, you got me. The same walk up. Spinning around. What have you done to me? Same chord, same chord. No repetitives. You can do that in there. Remember the, the pickup. sharp which i already showed you i'm not gonna go over the same stuff f sharp minor nine so the new chord is e which is a e in the a e major chord which is e b flat and, the, and e in the bass if you want to do the one five one or you could do the one five e flat b flat or e flat b flat e flat and then you got a b an e and a That's an E flat, E, it's an E chord, I'm sorry, E, B, E. Then you got, um, in the right hand, B, E, and you got G sharp. Now this is an E major chord, but it's just inverted, uh, which simply means, like this is the root, and you got one, five, one, so I'm inverting it, so I'm bringing this, which is the five, down to the bottom, which makes it a um, second inversion. So you got E, and this is the, the first inversion, and then this is the second inversion, but I'm just bringing it down here. Same chord. A little theory for you. <laughs> so you got... Uh, so this chord is a D major 9, um, which is uh, D in the bass, A, D, and a lot of the chords, like, you know, you can do this one five one thing. I say it a lot in my videos. So just, you know, get used to doing that just to make your chord more full. So that's D, A, and D again. And in the right hand, you got, um, you got A, you got C sharp, you got D, and you got F sharp. So... It just walks down, so I'm gonna show you, and you're gonna see it's the same chords we did in the um, in the verse. So you got remember this this passing chord, the C sharp. I'm giving same chord we learned, same B chord, and then you go back to the C sharp minor chord again, and then you land on the F sharp minor, same chords. And then, like, so I'm, I'm going to show you how the song goes. Because um, it's the same chords, but the timing is a little bit different. So you got... The last time, the last. 
chord. You do a D major 9 again. So I'm going to give you this chord. Same thing, D, A in your left. Then you got C sharp, E, F sharp, and A in your right. D, um, D major 9. So again, D, A, D flat. Sorry, C sharp, E, F sharp, A. So, um, so again, She goes back into the chorus, uh, uh, the pre-chorus again, the same thing. Um, baby, 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 it's a mystery. Mm, you got me spinning around. Same thing. You can just, just have fun with this song. Put as many chords as you want. Like, if you want to do the, the pickups, like I said, the you don't have to do it. You can just play the regular chords, the straight. Baby, baby. I'm just singing to help you kind of get a feel for the song. Don't judge me on my singing, please, because it sucks. So anyway, that's that. So the only other part she does is the hold me, where it's a little bit of movement. So um, so uh, she, I guess she's coming out of the... Uh, Think it's different? The same chord. Now the only difference is they do like a little, um, I guess a little chord movement. Let me see. Uh, they go. I'm uh, sorry. So basically what they do is they did the same thing in the left hand, like I told you, B, F sharp, and B. And then what you're going to do is you're going to do F sharp, A, and D. It's still a B minor 9 chord. And um, you just pretty much, just like just doing a, a little uh, movement on the chord. So this pretty much makes it an 11. So B minor 9 to a B minor 11. Um, so, so you got, I'm going to show you F sharp, A, and D. And then you go from that chord to E, A, and C sharp. So you're going, so you're pretty much one finger stays on the on this uh, A, and then you come down to this um, E, A, C sharp. So. Got that? So it's, these are the two chords off the B. This is B minor 9 and B minor 11. Second part is the F sharp minor nine to the minor to the uh, F sharp uh, minor eleven. So you got E, so you got F sharp, C sharp, and F sharp in the bass. Then you got E, uh, A, and C sharp in your right, and then you go from that to this, which is an E, G sharp, and B. So. And love me. 
love me right away. And then this one thing is true. I'm sorry. Uh, this one thing. So for this one thing, you go back to that B minor nine, same chord. So again. Uh, up is like a B, C sharp, D, and then it jumps to F sharp, and then you got a G, but the chord is a C major, C major chord, so the walk up again is, da, 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 I will die for you, so I'm gonna play the whole thing, the whole little bridge, uh, hold Sorry, that little end part, but it's, it's all the same chord. So, so when she does, um, after she does the bridge, um, this is the same. It's just the F sharp chord when she does that build that build up when she's like, it's all it's all F sharps, and then she and then she goes back into the uh, chorus. Questions, comments, uh, you know, message me, let me know. Do you like the video? Is it easy to understand? You know, give me some feedback so I can, you know, see how to make the videos better. But um, I'll continue putting them out and uh, hopefully it helps somebody. Have a good one. Peace.